So Charlie, how has being at Eastwood Public School changed your life? Being at Eastwood Public School has changed my life by helping me and teaching me all the essential life skills. It's really helped me on my path to becoming an engineer. What about you, Darini? So I want to be a lawyer and Eastwood Public School has introduced three main things, debating, writing and public speaking. I find it really interesting defending a topic that I really believe in because I find it's like justice and I want to help people. So Darini, what are some of your memorable moments in primary school? One of them was when I had my first speech in year two to become SRC and I got in. That's what sparked my interest in public speaking. My second one was when I wrote my first narrative that I was quite happy with in year three that addressed racism and belonging. So what about you? What are some of your memorable moments? I remember in year two, I had a teacher called Miss Edie and she had a toy monkey called Abraham. During the last week of school, I had received the monkey and I was really happy. I also remember a time when I was about to get school captain badge. I was sitting in the hall and I was really nervous and excited and when they announced my name, I was really ecstatic. So Charlie, what are some of your hopes and dreams for the future? Well, my hopes and dreams are quite simple. I hope to get a good education and become an engineer in the future, which has always been my dream. What about you, Darini? I want to be a successful lawyer that can really help people and be able to sustain a happy family at the same time. So guys, what do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be a secret agent. I want to be a race car driver. I want to be a swimming teacher. I want to be a secret agent. A police officer. A dancer. When I grow up, I want to be a doctor. When I grow up, I want to be a tennis player. When I grow up, I want to be a scientist. When I grow up, I want to be an artist. So why do you want to do those things? Is there a reason? Because I just drive to the racing car before. So you can see what if people are doing hacking or bad things. Because I like swimming. Because you will tell secrets to other people. Because, well, I want to see my dad uh, when I go to the police station. Because I can be really good at dancing. Because you can help people. Because there's an experiment where it explodes. Because I like to draw. How do you think going to school changes your life? Then you turn into a grown-up. It will change my life because when I used to be sad, I would be happy. I don't know. After year 12, you'll be a grown-up. Because, well, you learn things about the things that you want to grow up. And you can get smarter. So you can learn more. So you can apply numbers. So you can learn. So you can get smarter. So what do you want to do after you finish primary school? So when you're at, what, like us in year six? I don't know. I want to do experiments. I want to do fun things. I want to do some maths and English. Uh, maybe do some uh, more learning in high school. You do harder stuff than kindergarten and your normal. Plusing giant numbers. So you can... Learn more so you can get smarter. You can get a lot more smarter than you are in kindergarten. Thank you, guys. These are year six students from Eastwood Public School that we're going to interview. So our first question for you, how do you think education at Eastwood Public School has changed your view on life? It helped me a lot and I learned a lot of things. It probably made me think a lot more about school. It's pretty obvious that EPS, um, everyone gets a try at everything. So especially at EPS has made me more open-minded towards life itself. Same as her, life at EPS has also helped me be more open-minded in different activities and in different cultures as everyone here is different. EPS makes me feel like what career do I want to choose? Like I used to not like maths but now I really like it. How do you think it will change your future self? The school definitely made me a lot more interested in nature and biology so yeah that's probably what I'll do. So it's made me more confident because even if I do make a mistake I know that at least I tried. When I go into high school and university I'll continue doing debating and even maybe become an adjudicator. EPS has crossed out the subjects I'm okay at and showed um, me what like I'm really excellent at. So like maths, I'm really good at that. So I'm thinking of a maths related career. So 
What do you want to do when you finish school? Marine biology, because that's what I'm very passionate about. And I've learned a lot about it at school. And I've also found some really good interest in other topics. At EPS, I've developed my love of just designing in general. So for example, I like to make like little maps and like drawings of stuff. So I'm thinking maybe some kind of an engineer related topic. What I'm thinking now is I want to become a pediatrician. But of course, while I'm still waiting to get my licenses for all of that, I'll probably become an adjudicator to also learn more about debating myself and get a little bit of extra money. I really enjoy maths. I want to be like a doctor or a scientist. Very cool answers. Thank you guys for coming around today. Thank you.